Do you want to receive a good education to gain the desired standard of living? Then aim higher because the values and experience of people in science, art and culture are the most important. Wealthy people transcend the borders of a world that would be easy to live in. Are you choosing a subject related to well-paid jobs? Aim higher. Study your favorite subjects in Europe in the best traditions of high schools and universities rich in history, talents and atmosphere. Are you choosing qualified specialists to gain proven knowledge and reach the depths and secrets of professionalism? Aim higher. A true teacher will share all they have understood, but most importantly, they will awaken the desiring student to find for independent search in you. A true teacher will impress you with their generosity by giving you a place in their heart. From hundreds of lectures, you will only remember one or two of their phrases, but they will become the keys to opening infinite doors throughout your whole life. So then you are free to make your choice and aim higher. To create champions with their own hands while being at the top themselves, it would seem it's the fate of God. But God always has helpers. For example, in sports, those are trainers, people that train future athletes. Only they know the true value of victory. The best of the best, the most equal among the equals, that's how we know them. And that's exactly how they will enter into the history of world sports. It was programmed long before the Soviet Union championships. It was confirmed by many control exercises and tests. By and large, half of the victory is thanks to the coach, who is also a teacher, psychologist, physiologist, biomechanist, biologist, a doctor and simply a very good person and, among other things, has a totally parental attitude towards me and I consider him my parent. The coach plays the most direct role. The coach is the leader and I am his underling. He offers me very good training options and advice. He manages plans and observes. And I execute the task and give feedback. These words of the Olympic champion Ukrainian Valery Borzov, who was the king of sprint in the 1960s to 1970s, were written down in sports textbooks. These words are about his phenomenal victories at short distances and his coach Valentin Petrovsky. After all, an athlete's success does not just depend on excellent physical shape, dedication and luck. It is also thanks to the precise mathematical calculation of their trainer based on the profound knowledge of the human body. So we introduce you to the National University of Ukraine for Physical Education and Sports. This university is in the top 10 of specialized educational institutions for sports in the entire world. It was an elite university at first, as there were only 20 candidates for first place. First of all, the students got jobs. Secondly, there was a great demand in specialists in this sphere. And thirdly, our students received support, including two sets of sports uniforms and free meals, because our university had state funding. That allowed students to receive high-quality education, and there were corresponding requirements to the teachers. There was a real cult of physical development in the 1930s in the Soviet Union. At that time, in Kharkiv, the capital of Ukraine in those years, the State Institute of Physical Education was created. Young people had to be able to run, jump, swim, shoot well and also lead a healthy lifestyle. Enthusiastic teachers and students laid the foundations for the new generation of future winners in sports. And the university has preserved those traditions to this very day. Here you develop as a personality, as an athlete, and just as a person who wants to develop themselves physically, psychologically, morally, spiritually, and become more disciplined. And there is kind of a part of management, a part of a sports coach, 
and a part of a person who looks into the future. That is, they will not remain at the level of a couch potato holding a TV remote control device and drinking a beer bottle. They must look further than our children, grandchildren and great-grandchildren in order to prevent our generation from rotting to the core but making it thrive. That is, evolution should not stop at only inventing new computer programs. This year, the renowned university will celebrate its 88th anniversary. Among its graduates are the legends of sports Larissa Latinina, Boris Shachlin, Valery Borzov, Serhi Bubka, Nina Bocharova, Alexander Volkov, Volodymyr Holubnichi, and Volodymyr Klitschko. 113 champions and 297 Olympic medalists. Not every university can boast this many outstanding graduates. Throughout all these years, young people from 60 countries of the world receive diplomas in one of the leading universities of Ukraine. Players of different national teams have the opportunity to study for eight years here. That is two years for one course, given the heavy load of practicing of national teams, as they cannot always find the time to attend classes. Most of them want to become trainers, but some of them want to become organizers of the advancement of physical education in Ukraine. We have many departments besides those for trainers. We have one department in which the athletes study, and we also have management, tourism and sports medicine in faculties. The university has a good athletic base, and graduates return not only to their home countries, but also to other countries that invite them. The fact is that the diplomas they earn are accepted and valid in Latin America, the United States and EU countries, so they have a wide field of activity after graduating. No matter how bright a sport career is, it's always a fleeting moment. But life goes on after one sport's career ends. Then an athlete has to decide what to do further in life. That means sharing experience, raising successors and building a healthy nation. It is the choice of the champions. In this case, a university diploma is not just a piece of paper. The quality of knowledge gained at the National University of Ukraine in physical education and sports is confirmed by facts. Most champions and winners of the most important world competitions were trained by coaches that graduated from here. Sports give you skills, while the university offers you opportunities. If you have a diploma, you can go somewhere and say that you want to be a trainer. But in any case, the best experience is that which you gained yourself. You might give it your all during training, but it's 50-50 in competitions. It depends on luck. There are many things that can influence the result. I used to think that it's first place or nothing. But with time I realized that there is always competition, you get older and new young athletes engage in sports, and you will not always be first. In other words, you might win today, but you also might lose tomorrow. You simply have to accept this fact and take it in stride. In addition to trainers in various sports themselves, the university prepares physical education teachers for certain learning institutions, sports managers and lawyers, specialists in the field of tourism, recreation and sports medicine, rehabilitologists and sports journalists. It offers full-time and part-time studies, master's degrees and postgraduate studies, and it has a preparatory department for foreign students. The university has a dormitory, a wonderful swimming pool and a modern fitness club. Many students already successfully combine studying with working in private sports clubs, providing themselves financially. At the same time, graduates of the university are also in demand outside Ukraine. Our athletes work as trainers in many sports schools abroad. Take the U.S., for example. You go there and see that the Russian-speaking coaches you knew and trained together with are developing gymnastics there. The same goes for Canada. That's because our school, our education, and the fact that there are Ukrainian trainers are highly valued abroad. If they graduate from this university, that means that they are very well trained professional coaches. The specialized sports university has been successfully training choreographers for several years. The explanation is simple. Good dance trainers have always been in great demand. First, dancing is a mass culture just like sports. Secondly, dancing produces the hormone of happiness. Thirdly, dancing keeps people in good physical shape. Every year, the list of dance specializations in the university is on the rise. Initially, 
There was only sports dancing, then acrobatic rock and roll in modern dances, and then choreography. On top of that, they cover all of its types. Folk, modern, classical, and ballroom choreography were added to the program. There are several quite serious subjects that allow graduates to become great specialists in their field. We have a very strong school of medical and biological disciplines, including anatomy, human physiology, and physiology of sports. This is another one of our advantages that they take advantage of, as they are well versed in those biological sciences. I'm sure it helps and will help them in their careers. This is about biomechanics and biochemistry, which allow one to learn how the human body works. Energy systems of dancers work at very high levels, so the trainer must know how to help them, how to prevent them from injuries, and how to develop their potential. Of course, technical and psychological training is a key element in their line of work. Зрозуміло, технічної, якоїсь психологічної підготовки – це дуже важливо. It seems as if they have found the golden rule, meaning a balance between the world of sports with its emotions and ambitions and the world of science. The uniqueness of this symbiosis is in its end result, which is top-notch personnel, successful graduates and their achievements. Since its creation, the Physical Education University had a team spirit. Both teachers and students had one goal – to win. No platform can exist without science. In sports, it is the cycle of training competitions and the preparation of athletes to achieve high results. You won't go to a coach that will simply propose to you a training session. They must know the nuances of the body of an athlete and then recommend the training stages. Coaches cannot give difficult tasks without scientific justification. More and more sports and athletes are now appearing. Our athletes show excellent results on the international arena, and that is due to the fact that our sports science is gradually developing, starting with education in the university. As a result, the graduates of this institution are highly successful. The university has its own research institute for physical education and sports and a sports traumatology center. After all, experts believe that sport without science is like training without competitions. It all started with laboratories. They studied the effect of heavy physical activity on the bodies of athletes, as well as exhaustion and recovery. They searched for hidden reserves to achieve even higher goals. One of the largest such laboratories in the former Soviet Union was located here in Kyiv. Probably due to the fact that our athletes are leaders in the international arena, we can't let ourselves have subpar equipment. Therefore, all the equipment we have is either unique or that which exists in similar laboratories around the world in small amounts. With the equipment we have, our specialists can provide data that allows athletes to achieve such high results. Members of national teams get examined at the research institute. Sports science is of paramount importance for the training of athletes. Many of the techniques they apply are quite unique. The ability to conduct research allows for advancement and keeping up with the times. So this is just one of the main reasons that students from different countries give preference to study in this specialized Ukrainian university. In addition to Ukrainian and foreign languages, they also study general education disciplines. The areas of study in our preparatory department are engineering, natural, medical, biological and humanitarian. Depending on which university they're going to study at, ours or a different one, they're also taught individual general educational subjects, so that they're prepared. They know they can contact teachers at any time in order to discuss any problems they may have. They have all the contact numbers, the communication is continuous, and we visit the dormitories all the time to see how they live there. The university trains cadres that ensure the health of the nation. Students learn functional diagnostics and always have unique sports training bases at their disposal. They use the latest developments of scientists recognized by the International Olympic Committee as among the best in the world. Even such technologically advanced China sends its students to study in this university. Sidious Altius Fortius – Faster, Higher, Stronger 
It was not by accident that the motto of athletes all around the world became the motto for the National University of Ukraine of Physical Education and Sports. This gives ambition to learn to win not only in competitions, but also in life by the examples of the best athletes and become one of them. The students and the rector are one team, and they will win.